they just start? <laughs> yeah, it's not. Oh! Okay, okay. I was just thinking, like, Vukario, no way. <laughs> it's just computer, it's just a button check. So, yeah, like I said, Zero Speed Zam is most likely to link coming in from Kunai Kazakun. <laughs> the crowd's hyping at CPU. Can they, can they hear the crowd? Oh, good. So, yeah, you can hear it. The crowd's going hype against the CPU for whatever reason. We'll take it. <laughs> so, that's JV3 from Luxus against the CPU. Level 3, I think. <laughs> it's something, you take it. Yeah, level 3. Perfect prediction on point. <laughs> um, Kuna is kinda the kind of, uh, TO, so he might have stuff to do. Or he might just not have stuff to do and go in right away. <laughs> like this guy just keeps trolling me, throwing in screen transitions. Making me think that something's gonna happen, but it's not. Um, yeah, for the first match, I'm pretty sure they're not going final destination like Omega. Um, pretty sure that's gonna bang, that's gonna get banned out. Uh, projectiles just feel too strong at that stage for the lane. So let's just pretty much gonna avoid avoid that. Yeah, we're going to Stalin City, lower ceiling. So Zero Suit might get kills even earlier, but so can Toon Link with his up air and up smash. He got up smash, uh, like the bump into up smash and bump into up air, forward air, back air, that kind of stuff. But I'm pretty sure he's not gonna go fish for that. Like, it's not because of, he, he will fish for that, but not because of the stage. He's gonna fish for that anyways. That's like the only kill confirm Toon Link got. So Lux is actually going in with the neutral airs. Uh, I think he can get a punish, a uh, huge punish, or any more if he gets. But right now it's not really working out, but like, he's using the get off me move, the up tilt. The super early move that comes out super quick, uh, puts him in the air, but doesn't really give you a follow up. If he, yeah, if he's an uncomfortable spot, spot right now. Jesus, I can't even talk. And he also stuff, but he gets it right back. I'm not sure that should have killed. Like, I'm pretty sure he just missed the eye on that, tried to drift out and just the eye into his death. Clean up kill string. Well, literally just smashing the button, but it works, so why not? And unlike I expected, Kuna is actually going in. Like he is playing aggressive. He's taking every trade. He, no, like he isn't even trading trades. He just goes in and beats every option like Lux has got. And there he is. Take the clean up air to kill. Uh, that's a good tower city, that one killed regardless. But still. That was a really quick match, actually. Like, they took it. What was it? Two minutes thirty? Two minutes? The guy right, right next to me shook his head. He's not even watching. Perfect. <laughs> so yeah, really quick match. I expected a real camping match, but right now they're just going in. They're going ham. They want to kill each other. As far as I know, they don't hold any personal grudge against each other. They just uh, looks like they just want to finish the matches. <laughs> so unlike I thought, like I thought, like Kunai is gonna ban like Battlefield or Dreamland, and then Luxus is gonna come to the other one. But that didn't happen. He just went to straight, uh, straight to Smash World. I'm pretty sure he should have used platforms. Uh, 
But the way Kuna is playing right now, not really too... Like, he is projectile heavy, yes. But he isn't using it to camp, he's going aggressive with it. So, maybe that's actually kind of good choice. Oh, kind of a bad punish there. Punishing down here with 4 tilt. Uh, Could have definitely gotten a grab out of that. Yeah, like Luxus is not really playing on point right now. He's just uh, trying to get some kind of damage in, hoping it works. He's not really playing like efficient. He's just throwing stuff out and hopes he gets it, kind of. Yeah, and then we just saw it for a short, uh, for a brief moment. If you give Kunai the time, he is gonna play and camp you out. Like he. He doesn't have to go in, he has no reason to. Why would he? At some point you're gonna take some damage. Oh, nice back air. Not quite sure if that's a read, but oh, I'm pretty sure he just threw the hitbox out. But it did work out and that was actually kind of good choice. It did cover a lot of options. And... <clears throat> like even if he missed, he couldn't have gotten punished for that. Nice DI on 4 there, kind of living. For now. Oh, missing the bomb to throw there. But there he gets the to throw there, cleaning up the stock. So it's one to one right now. Slight lead for Luxus, but from the way they're playing, I don't really think he's got the upper hand. Gets a grab, gets punished by the boomerang. So I waited a little longer and took the invincibility from the grab to just uh, ignore the boomerang hitbox. Like he hasn't gotten any up air string yet. There is grab. Um, got some one up air, but then it's gone. Mm. It's a forward smash right there, 22%. Pretty much like there may have been better punishes for that, but it's really good percentage and you just take it, there's no reason not to. Oh, I don't like that. Shit, just sitting there in the shield for like three, four seconds maybe, and just hoping something happens that you can punch out of shield, that, that's not the way you want to play. If you play against a projectile heavy uh, character, you just don't want to sit in your shield and hope you can punch something. You either gotta counter the projectiles and kind of avoid them to a point that you can punish a missed projectile or you want to just go in and not even let the projectile come out. You don't want to just eat them and hope you can punish something. That's not... Yeah. But, like he, he did us that entire thing, the entire match. And he got punished for that over and over again. It's another bump for there and uh, loses his final stock. And gets sent to the bracket.